Hi everyone, it's Alexandria. And Michael. And welcome to Never Better Club. Today we're taking on Maddie's Spicy Cocoa Toffee Nuts. And it's for a good cause. So today we are eating the Spicy Cocoa Toffee Nuts by Mad Cow. We just recently did uh, another Mad Cow challenge, which was the peppermint bark, which is so, so delicious. Really wish I could have tasted it a little better. Michael and I are gonna, I would, I think we're gonna repeat it. Um, this, this company, Mad Cow, they um, donate their products all, you know, go to a good cause. So we are uh, pretty excited to just purchase more challenges from them in the future. I think it's it's pretty great to have. This is produced and distributed by harvest912.org. Yeah, awesome. It's yep, really, the really website inspiring. is on the back here. You can see along with all the other ingredients. We'll um, put it in the description too. Yeah, sounds good. Uh, the ingredients are peanuts, honey, butter, cocoa powder, salt, mad cow hot sauce. Cool, I bet you they have that for sale, I would assume. Uh, Carolina Reaper pepper, seven pot primo pepper, ghost pepper, Trinidad scorpion pepper, habanero pepper, vanilla, and spices. So it sounds really, really good. They look beautiful too. It's, um, I, this is one of those challenges, which many of them are like this, where Michael does the purchasing and I do the consuming. And mm -hmm. I um, got, we got these in the mail and I expected it to be more brittle-like or like some sort of like clump or bark, but yeah. these are kind of like individual it's like a packet cocoa of nuts, yeah. peanuts, yeah. Yep. Kind of like a little death nut packet, if you will. Yep. So that's gonna be interesting. You know, peanut challenges are not really easy on your stomach. I we'll, we'll tell you how this falls in the death nut three kind of, yeah. you know, there's four categories there, so we'll tell you where it falls. I prepped politely today with respect, not as well as I could have, but well enough, yes. I see Michael's eyes. You want to read the rules? They are looking towards my phone. He wants me to read the rules, so I will. Here they are. No food or drink for the duration of the challenge. You must video your challenge without edits and remain on camera at all times until the challenge is complete. Read your short disclaimer. The cocoa toffee nuts must be opened from a sealed packet on screen and remain on screen until they are fully consumed. Cocoa toffee nuts must be chewed and not swallowed whole. That's not a problem for me, as you all know. Uh, the cocoa toffee nuts, after fully consuming them, show an empty mouth and then you begin your four minute burn time. That sounds just like a peppermint bark. Yep. Very good. And then you've completed the challenge. So right. I'm, I'm excited. I'm excited too. I'm hungry. The disclaimer there. My we'll... eye is itchy. Oh yes, I, Alexandria Tersek, I'm over 18 years of age of sound mind, and I've read and understood the hot sauce product disclaimer on the League of Fire website. In summary, I accept that the League of Fire, their suppliers and manufacturers will under no circumstance be held responsible for or liable for any claims of injury or damage arising from me consuming this product or multiples thereof. I acknowledge and agree to this without question. I'm Michael Morgan, I'm over 18 years of age of Sound Mind and have read and understood the hot sauce product disclaimer on the League of Fire website. In summary, I accept that the League of Fire, their suppliers, manufacturers will, under no circumstances, be responsible for or liable for any claims of injury or damage arising from me consuming this product or multiples thereof. I acknowledge and agree to this fact without question. All right. You look nice today. Well, thank you. You look nice too. Thank you. Here we go. Wow, my oh, first thought when I looked at these was, it, like it looks alien-like. I don't know why, I, you know, if you can see, they've got a nice sheen on them. Yes, here is our lovely empty packet. I wish I could tell you if there's a smell or not, I'm certain there is, I just can't pick up on it yet. Well, we can just kind of get into it, right? Yeah, okay. Might as well just, yeah, dive in, cheers. My nose is already running. <laughs> cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Hmm. So good. Mmm. Careful 
worry too. Heard. A little sticky, but I mean it's brittle, so. Hmm. burning in your mouth just curious it's a little odd for me what is it burning in a very specific place hmm. what the heck it's the very tip of my tongue hmm. i don't know what's going on here it burns so bad mm -mm. i ate a lot of spicy things earlier i don't know It hurts so bad. It's really tasty. Very it's so nice tasty. Brittle. The heck? Hmm. Mm. I'm not making it up either. Never before. This is good for my sinuses. Clear me out a little. Hmm. It looks like the same order of pepper ingredients as the challenge we did yesterday. So. careful where I chew, like you said, just in case. All right, tip of my tongue burns going away now. Well, I mean a little, it's still there kind of, so strange. All right, last handful. Whew. Good idea. That's a unique challenge. It really is. And there is some building heat happening. I gotta swallow. Uh. Let me start this timer. I have story time from earlier. It's a crazy thing happened to me. Your time, it's fine. Uh, uh. Let, me, let me say one thing. Um, yeah. What's funny about this? Oh, it's hot. And now that I'm done chewing, I have a pretty low mouth heat on this for some reason. But I feel like my body thinks I'm doing a death at three, and like my forehead's sweating some. No, I've got a, I've got a higher mouth heat. 
than yesterday. It's higher than really? um, um, yesterday, yeah. No, for me it's definitely yesterday. So the, the prepper mint, I gave a three. I'd say this is maybe like a two. Yeah, see, and yesterday I said two. I think this is a three. Um, Very tasty. My throat's burning. Like so, in the world of League of Fire points, I would just do this for fun. Okay. This is a fun snack. It's extremely tasty. If I was snacking on this, I'd probably eat half. Excuse me, half the pack. Just because it's so loft sweet. Um, you guys know how I feel about sweets. I do like them in moderation. Uh, I think it's a wrapper. I cut the wrapper from yesterday, so. Yeah, we've done uh, both the Mad Cow. <clears throat> yeah, wow. So the. I got a little burn going on. Maddie's and the toffee nuts. Which I am appreciative of. That feels good. <laughs> yeah. Was it. <clears throat> You know, that's been following us social media and our, our previous video. We've been sick for about a week. Yeah. And uh, today's like one of our first days where we're starting to really get better, but it's been a, been a tough, tough few days. So looking forward to getting back in the swing of things. Like I want to take on some, some tough ones. Yeah, you can actually and... talk today. Which is yeah, I can talk today. Yesterday I could barely talk. So that's a big improvement. Um, oh yeah, story time. I'll talk while I, my mouth's on fire. Um, oh, earlier today, yeah. I had this really interesting experience happen where I was eating habaneros, cause uh, I just felt like it. So I'm eating habaneros earlier, and um, I was sitting on the couch watching some League of Fire videos, and I'm eating them, and I don't know what it was, cause I wasn't really counting, it was like five or six, but I get to this habanero, and I can't taste well, so I can't, you know, you don't taste the that distinct habanero taste that I really enjoy and love, so it's kind of just like chewing through pepper, and then you get the burn, and um, I, I get to this pepper, and I was like, huh, this one doesn't taste like much, and I was sitting there, and I said, oh, something's different about this pepper, and I think I got a super hot habanero. It was really fun. It was unexpected. I mean, it didn't like blow my mind or something, but I was sitting there salivating for like a good 10 minutes after I ate it thinking like, wow, that had to be one of the hottest habaneros I've ever eaten in my life. It was like a rogue one. And it was, it was a larger one too. And I don't know. I'm so jealous. Yeah. Yeah. That happens to me occasionally where I'll get that rogue pepper. I'll be eating like a pile of them and I'll eat one and I'm like, holy smokes, <laughs> that one was noticeably hot. And then you eat another and it, it's not as hot as the one you had before. What do I call Oh, I call it pepper, pepper roulette. Yeah. I play that. Michael and I used to play that when we first met with like different types of less hot peppers. But you basically eat them until you get the, the winner pepper. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, real quick, I wanted to do a shout out to uh, Mr. Bullcow. We were watching his... Uncle um, Bullcow. Uncle Bullcow. Sorry, uh, <laughs> to, uh, we were Mr. Watching... Uncle Bullcow, hello. <laughs> Sorry, I'm still a little sick, guys. Um, his take on the peppermint uh, Maddie's uh, last night, and he showed that pop tart, and uh, the, the, the death death tart or the yeah. whatever it's called. What's Hell it called? Tart. Hell tart. So we were doing some research on that. I, there's only one video we could come across on. YouTube. I already knew about that though, Uncle yeah, Bullcow. When you posted that, Brian Ams, he yeah. he posted it, and it I looks I, like it absolutely killed him. I mean, he, he took one bite. And one he bite, and he yeah. was he was done. I mean, you know, Michael's like ah theatrics, but maybe I don't. Know. But I think some I think sometimes these are not theatrics. You know, people are legitimately blown up by these things. Mm. So now I want to do this pop tart. So I want to do the hell tart I found too. Found the website. We're gonna order one. Are we gonna? We're gonna order yeah. one. I told Michael. I said. Don't but now buy I want to see um, Uncle one. Bullcow do it because I'm, I'm super curious. No, you, you can go first, Uncle Bullcow. We'll watch. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I, we're we're gonna do it. Well, if if we say we're gonna do something, we'll do it regardless. But I, I can already see this. I'm, I'm gonna meet uh, Uncle Bullcow in person. Oh. He's gonna like to you. It's Mr. Bullcow. <laughs> Mr. Mr. Bull yeah, Michael. Sorry about that. Michael's bad. But anyway, bad that pop tart names, that but... pop tart looks really interesting. So the fact yeah. that it lit him up like that, and there's no other videos. So you guys, this burnt my mouth. It did. I'm drinking water right now, trying to just. I mean, it doesn't help, but you know, 
Oh yeah, this was feels nice temporarily. Th I she has less mouth pain. Yeah, yesterday I was like blah. I don't feel anything. But this one, uh, you know, some of these things are circumstantial. It just depends on the day. And uh, yeah, interesting, fun. It's been great. Yep. So we should probably end this because we take too long sometimes. Well, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Have a great day. See you guys soon. Bye. Bye.